Hey guys, so today I'm going to be filming my travel album scrapbook flip through. I have my first album and my second album. So this one holds from when I was a kid up until 2016. And then this one holds end of 2016 till previous, future, that type of thing. So um, I don't have a tripod. I seem to have mislocated it. Um, and so I'm going to just be holding the phone, so hopefully it won't be too shaky. But I've had a few requests on Instagram, actually a lot of requests, on Instagram to do flip-throughs of my albums. And so if you want to follow me on there, I'll leave it down in the description. But yeah, so this is my first one. I'm not going to go into too much detail, like I said, because I have two books to show. Or I might just do like one video and then the next video will be... Um, the second album. Maybe that's what I'll do. So this will be the first album. So I just have it in this um, world, well, yeah, the map that I got at Hobby Lobby. And I like it because it has the um, book plate there, if that's what you call it. Um, and it's really sturdy. I like it. So anyway, so um, the first page just holds a map of the world and I like to put that in the beginning of my books um, I don't know if I'm gonna put like where I've been in this one because this holds a lot of vacations <laughs> so I don't know if I'll do that maybe um, somewhere else in the book but yeah so this is the first page um, I'm sorry if you're gonna get glare I am doing the best I can but um, this one is just scrapbooking from when I was a kid my mom and dad took me and my brother on so many road trips when I was younger so I mean this I think is in Arizona this is a layout I did of um, me my mom and my brother and then this I do some of this these books are not finished I have a lot of journaling to do I but yeah just letting you know so this is has like Vegas Universal Studios Grand Canyon um, the dam I mean there's so many places that we went they love to go out west. So, um, there we go. That's got a mixture of places. And this is when I went to Cancun. I lost all my photos because they were in the basement and we had a flood. So these are the only photos. Hi, you're kind of in the sunshine there. Um, got a bad glare now. There we go. Um, this is when I went to, anyway, I went to Cancun, Mexico for like two weeks with my dad and, um, Gizmo, you're in the way. Hold on one second. Sorry about that. Okay. So anyway, these are the only photos that I was able to save from the flood. So I'm so thankful that I was able to save these because these were taken with, um, what is it called? Disposable cameras. So yeah, I have a lot of journaling to do. But this is really special to me because this photo, you cannot walk up that um, that pyramid anymore. So I did have a photo of me and my dad all the way at the top and it got ruined. But thankfully I have this one. So these are really special to me. Then um, I have a few photos from when me and my dad and went to Kentucky. So this is just scrapbook paper, but these are at a national park there and that's who we went to see. And then we went to... Um, Myrtle Beach, South Carolina before Kentucky. So that's the only photo I have from South Carolina. But yeah, like I said, I have a ton of journaling. Then I went to um, Disney World for the first time in Florida in 2009. So these are all taken with disposable camera. But I have, I still had my um, ticket. I don't know how I still had that, but yeah, I had the postcards too. So I'll just quickly flip through this. These are really old. This is right after I graduated uh, high school. That roller coaster was a lot of fun. And I still had our medieval times like thing because we went to that there. That was a lot of fun. I don't know what I'm going to put there yet. I'll have to figure that out. But this is starting um, my first time to Michigan. Um, my boyfriend and his family have their own island in Michigan. It's... Um, been passed down and so they go every summer and this was my first time going so I just kind of documented our road trip there because it's like an eight hour drive um, from where we are in Ohio so just selfies um, this one is a flower my boyfriend picked it was really cute 
Um, I did a big layout there. These are just snapshots. This is another uh, special photo because they're, this is one of their dogs and it passed away. So that's really sweet that I got a photo of her on the island. That's one of their cabins on the island. And this is a panoramic photo of the block house, which is the only other building on their side of the island. So that's where we would stay. And then I got some sunset photos. Uh, we went sailing. My boyfriend loves to sail. Us in a hammock. Um, this is when I lost a lot of weight. I'm trying to get back to that. But yeah. And then just um, another layout. I really like this one. Meet me in the sunshine. And another layout. His sister took that photo. I really like that photo of us. Okay. And this starts Chicago. Um, this one is not done yet. I lost all these photos. So I had to take them from... Facebook and they got really grainy unfortunately um, but here's a postcard another postcard I love collecting postcards um, this is one of my favorite layouts I've ever done and it's so simple I love this photo of the Chicago theater we were leaving the Jesse J concert and it was raining and the, took that from the back of the cab and then from the bean I love that photo and then um, of the river and the buildings and then um, just some snapshots I took Kate Spade and the bean everybody says I'm obsessed with the bean <laughs> um, these this is unfinished but one day I'll finish it and I might do a layout about my favorite store which was central camera and then this starts Texas I have a lot to do with Texas I took so many photos it was so beautiful there um we went i w flew down to texas this is my first time flying by myself and i took two planes there and two planes back and this plane was so small and only fit one person on this side which they put me over here and then two people on that side and you felt every bump <laughs> um so i have so many photos i need to print but my dad works at big bend national park in texas and it's just, I love this photo I took of the sunset. It's just absolutely beautiful there. And I did some, like a drawing, um, photo of me, my dad driving. Um, another awesome photo I took. Like we were standing high up. We climbed all the way up and that was the view. Um, there's my camera, my dad. This is abandoned, oh, what is it called? coal and mine field or something like that I don't remember uh, another panoramic of Rio Grande River which you could walk all the way down in a few steps you'd be in Mexico like really easy to cross <laughs> um, yeah I have so many photos I need to print from that um, oh this is really cool this was actually a movie set in the middle of Big Bend park it wasn't the national park it was something else i forget what it's called but um yeah this was in a movie set just sitting in the hillside from like back in the 90s or 80s i can't remember but that's just a photo of me in one of the movie sets and that's in um one of the restaurants yeah i have so many photos that i need to print um okay this i'm gonna take out but um i had it in the other album this is new york so i was only in new york does not go lay down sorry I was only in New York for seven hours seven or eight hours it was just a day trip that me and um, Michael's two sisters took so it was just a girl thing and this is a photo I took on top of Rockefeller Center definitely recommend going up there during the day because you get a view of Empire 9-11 um, um, what's it called oh my goodness um, the new 9-11 uh, building oh my gosh I'm blanking um, <laughs> But yeah, and you get the Statue of Liberty way over there. And that's one of my favorite pictures that I took. Um, and then I have this Huber here, wood veneer, and a postcard. And then I have our, kind of our itinerary. Oh no, I thought I did. Um, but yeah, I'm just documenting here, Times Square. And here's Central Park. We went in the autumn, which was my dream, to go there in the autumn. Um, this was one of my favorite buildings, as you'll be able to tell. It's in, like, all my photos. Um, that's all of us. 
And that was like my dream photo to take in New York in the fall was of Central Park with someone on the rowboats with the bridge. So it just screams like you've got mail and gossip girl to me. Um, that's uh, the uh, waterfall thing in Central Park. Yo, that's called fountain hello um i took my wide angle or not my wide angle on uh, my wide instax polaroid so i took a picture up top it was their statue of liberty and central park you can see from rockefeller center i want to go back and do empire at night that's like one of my things i also want to do um it's on my bucket list to take a helicopter tour around um new york that's like been on my bucket list for like 10 years now and then this is Tiffany and Co. on the back of the postcard. And then this envelope just holds a bunch of stuff that I got and then a big photo. Um, yeah. So that ends this album number one. Um, I still have some work to do in this album. But I really love how much I was able to fit um, into here. I know it's going to get even thicker once I finish Texas. Um, but this is a very special book for me because I was able to put um, vacations from when I was younger and photos that I thought I lost, like Cancun. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you enjoy it. And if you are interested in seeing Volume 2, which holds Pittsburgh, Chicago, and uh, Harry Potter World, um, stay tuned. Thank you guys. Bye.